Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, we're diving deeper into WooCommerce discounts with smart coupons by WebToffee. We'll explore category-based restrictions, unlocking powerful control over your promotions. Let's jump in. Assuming you've installed and activated the plugin, navigate to the dashboard, click on Smart Coupons, and select Add Coupon. Just like any other WooCommerce coupon, input a unique code, a brief description, and move to coupon data. First, choose a coupon type. Let's go with a flexible percent discount of value 10. You can opt to apply the coupon automatically or schedule it for a specific time frame. Now, onto the main event, setting up category restrictions. Head over to the Usage Restriction tab and scroll down to find the Product slash Category Restrictions option. And, enable it. This section enables to set up of product-based restrictions. There is a dedicated video on that, go check it out after this one. Scroll down to set up category-based restrictions. Say you want the coupon to apply only to products from specific categories. Just select Categories down here. Now, the coupon will only apply to the products from these categories. As we hear, let's set up one more thing. Let's say you want to get a bit more specific. In the case of category hoodies, maybe you want the discount to apply only if there are at least two products from the category is present in the cart. No problem, just enable individual quantity restriction and set the requirement accordingly. Let's set one for shirts and two for hoodies. Publish the coupon and let's see it in action. Let me toss a pair of shoes into the cart. Note that shoes don't belong to the selected category. So, as per the logic, the product won't trigger the discount. Let's check the cart. Let me apply the coupon. And, sorry, this coupon is not applicable to selected products. Now, let me add a top to the cart, which belongs to the selected category, shirts. And coupon code applied successfully. There is our 10% discount. The thing to notice is that the discount only applies to the eligible product. Now, let's add another eligible product. The discount applies to the total value of eligible items. Perfect. But what if we try adding hoodies instead? Which also belongs to the selected category. But, no discount. Remember, we need at least two products from the category to be eligible for the coupon. Add one more hoodie, update the cart, and there's our discount, just like we wanted. That's how you set a basic category restricted coupon. But why stop there? Smart coupons offer you much more options. Let's check it out. Right now, the coupon applies if any of the listed products are in the cart. But let's switch it up. So it will only get applied if one product from shirts and two products from hoodies are available in the cart. To do that, up here, instead of any from below selection, select all from below selection. Save the changes. Let's check it out. I have a product from the category shirt here, but the coupon is not applied. Let's add two products from the category hoodies too. And, coupon code applied successfully. See how the discount only kicks in when all the required products are in the cart? Lastly, what if you want the coupon to apply to all products except those from a selected category? Delete the current condition, change the selection to any product from below selection, and just below here, choose the category you want to exclude. Now, the coupon won't apply to those excluded categories, simple as that. Save your changes and let's see it in action. I have a bunch of products in the cart, and see how the discount applies only to the subtotal of products, except those we excluded. And there you have it, category restrictions with smart coupons. But hey, this is just scratching the surface of what smart coupons can do. Don't forget to explore all the other fantastic features it offers. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more helpful content. And if you've got any questions, drop them in the comments or reach out to our support team.